Hey, what's going on guys? Sandy here and welcome back to some more Trollcraft. Now, dudes, today, I, I got some good news and I got some bad news. Uh, just like always. Uh, first, let me check real quick. Let me make sure I am recording. Uh, hold on. <laughs> Freaking last video was a catastrophe. Okay, that's recording. And that's recording. And okay, all three things are recording. We're good. So, <laughs> so dudes, like I said, I got some good news. And I got some bad news. Bad news first. Uh, I wasn't able to update my home. I'm going to be doing that after this episode. But the real bad news is, as you remember, I have a hidden house that I thought they weren't going to find. I was wrong. <laughs> they both immediately found it. And now I have two trolls waiting for me. They apparently didn't like the McDonald's theme song. But the good news, I'll show you the good news in a minute. It's gonna be good. So, okay, so I got some trolls in mind that I want to do today on Craner and Captain Sparkles. The, this is gonna be funny, but apparently we can watch videos now inside of Minecraft. We'll be checking that out soon. That has to do with Craner. And then here, nice base, bro. From Captain Sparkles, and I'm also missing all of my items. This is not cool. <laughs> and I also found a hidden portal. Oh, <laughs> this is going to be an interesting episode. Let me check again. Am I still recording? We are good. So I guess first up, uh, hey, Sunday, nice base, bro. Sparkles gave me the cords, Lel. How did Captain Sparkles find my base then? And why would he tell Craner? <laughs> the whole world's against me. Uh, anyway, watch the video I sent you right here when you have read these signs XOXO Craner. All right, Craner, what the freak do you have here? So I just got to click, I think, anywhere on the screen. Hold on. Hi, Sandy! Basically, I just wanted to explain to you what uh, is going on right now because I feel like you're gonna be kinda shocked, so make sure you're sitting down when you're watching this video. Anyway, Ian, you remember a few episodes ago where I gave you Gertrude that was married to Bobby, right? And then I gave- then you, you saw that I was also married to Gertrude, and then I gave you back this uh, Gertrude. Right here, like you wanted. The one that's married to you, right? Married to Sunday. This is the Gertrude that you wanted. And this is the Gertrude you've had all along, right? Yeah. Wrong. You see this golden lasso right here? Well, inside of this golden lasso, I have a little bit of a surprise for you. But before I show you that surprise, let's go back to the episode that you didn't see. Let's see what happened back there, shall we? Because I don't think you know what really happened Wh and who this really is. But it's you'll Gertrude. find out. A few weeks ago. Now, the way that we are gonna troll him is we have his Gertrude in one of these golden lassos, right? And this is Beatrice. Now, this Beatrice right here is married to me. So we're gonna change her to look exactly like Gertrude. So let's put down uh, Gertrude or Beatrice right here. We're gonna take the villager editor. <laughs> And call her Gertrude. Look for the Gertrude skin. Where? There it is. I'm not gonna tell him that I have the real Gertrude. I'm gonna let him think that I actually married his wife. Are you confused yet? Basically, the Gertrude that you just married is Beatrice, my wife. Let's see who's actually inside of the golden lasso, shall we? Gertrude, who is still married to Bobby. This is the original Gertrude. Your girlfriend and the one you married was my wife. I still have the real Gertrude right here. And I think that after she has seen that you married my wife, which by the way, I don't mind because I've always wanted to marry Gertrude myself. I don't think she wants to go back to you any day, anytime soon. Do you think so? She's all mine now, Ian. She's all mine. <laughs> She's still married to Bobby, but I'm going to change that very soon. <laughs> so apparently I married Craner's girlfriend, B. 
Beatrice, who looks like Gertrude, but isn't Gertrude. And Gertrude's married to Bobby, soon gonna be married to Craig. I have two questions. First question. Wait. The, this is... How, how is it... I, second... <laughs> second question. Craner? You need to reevaluate your priorities in life if you want another man to marry your wife. Let me send some footage back to him soon. So I just stole some resources from Craner to make this village editor. Don't tell him. <laughs> Gertrude, be, be a tr you are an imposter. I no longer love you. <laughs> but before I end my love with Gertrude, let's do one thing. So keep in mind, I'm recording this for later. <laughs> what we have here is Beatrice, my wife. <laughs> Here you go, Craner. I will make you witness what doesn't need to be witnessed. Click on Beatrice. Procreate. Yes. <laughs> and I'll be sending this to Craner soon enough. The freaking cuckold. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. I don't even know if I'll keep that in. But okay, name your baby. Uh, uh, Craner is stupid. St stupid. <laughs> Done. <laughs> baby girl, Craner is stupid. <sighs> well, he still has Gertrude, but we will get her back eventually. But for now, I have a troll plan for him. I've been working on this for a little bit. It's the- it's a demo diss track. I'll show you it a little bit. First thing I need to do, I'll, I need to tear down all of these web screens. There we go. I'm gonna hang on to these for later. We're gonna need these in a little bit. So what I'm gonna do, I, I need to get my freaking stuff back. So I'm guessing this was all Captain Sparkles. Let's see if we can get our stuff back. All right, let's see what's- uh, oh, it says. <laughs> all right, what is this? Uh, hey buddy, looks like some of your drives are missing. That doesn't seem too fun. <laughs> Head to these coordinates, maybe that- maybe that can help you find them. Uh, let me take a screenshot of this really quick. There we go, okay. You've gotta be kidding me! It looks like it's like two or three thousand blocks in this direction. So that's my house, and I gotta go in this direction. <sighs> Can a guy just live a normal life? Okay, so we're almost there. Oh, is that it? Hold on. Uh, it's a sign. I'm guessing this is it. Please descend, Ian. It's an elevator! I don't want to! Okay, okay, I'm gonna descend. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Please don't freaking kill me. Okay, okay, okay. Let's descend. Let's descend. Okay, okay, okay. How much wood could a woodchuck chuck in 20 seconds? If it chucks at a rate of five ticks, arbitrary wood units per second. What? <laughs> Nine hundred arbitrary wood units. Is Captain Sparkles giving me math problems? <laughs> what? Oh, there's a book in here. Let, let's play a game, he says. <laughs> All right, homie, what do you got for me? Hello, Ian. Look out the window. See the chest over there with TNT next to it. Your drives are in it. Whoa there, don't be too hasty to break out. I've got some test floor commands running that will set off the TNT if you break any of the blocks in this chamber. Now that we've gotten that out of the way, let's play a game. You're about to be asked four questions. Get one right, proceed to the next room. Get it wrong, the first TNT will blow up the chest. Oh, 
No, that's my stuff. And the next will blow up your drives that have just scattered on the ground. Sounds like fun, right? I mean, it's only all your items at stake. What are you waiting for? Answer stuff. So now I gotta do math. I don't fr- is it 1,000? Please. Yes! Oh, 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 no! Okay, my stuff's still good. Why did I hear exploding? Okay, next question. How much do you hate calculus? Uh, calculus is a great and useful thing. What's calculus? <laughs> um. Yeah, what's calculus? No! So Was that all my items? Hold on, if we do that one. Okay, that opens the door. How much math did it take to make Minecraft? Uh, a lot of math. <laughs> Are all... Mathematically speaking, how old is your mother? S Freaking... She's neither of these. 72 then. Okay, you're a w How am I a winner? You destroyed my stuff. Did you get all the questions right? Congratulations, you win nothing. Your drives are back in your base. Well played, Captain Sparkles. You have officially made me wet myself. <laughs> <sighs> Let's head home and find our drives. Well, that officially sucked. <laughs> uh, okay. Nice base, bro. Okay, so it says... Uh, uh, look in the floor for a block that seems a bit out of place. Where? I I'm just clicking everything. Maybe he put, like, a hidden chest. Hello, Beatrice. <laughs> Uh, I don't see any blocks that are out of place. Pl Pl Beatrice, have you seen anything? <laughs> ah. Okay, down the- yeah, that's the cave down there, but- ah, No, no, no! Beatrice! Is this it? Uh, broken ring. Beatrice- Oh, this is the broken ring from our marriage! I too will be adding that to the video to send to Craner. <laughs> this is a good day. Poor Beatrice, but... <laughs> now where the freak are my items? Well, I found it. <laughs> it's a camo chest. Go figure, right under here, this cobblestone block right there. Okay, let's throw all of this in here. There we go. We can now access all of our stuff. So what I'm going to do in between episodes, I'm going to, uh, like, right after I finish editing this and upload this, I'm going to make my house pretty and pink. <laughs> Since they know where I live anyways, we're going to do that. But what I'm going to do now, like I said, I found this portal. This is Captain Sparkle's portal back to his base. I have a plan for that. I have two trolls that I want to do this episode. It's going to be pretty good. So uh, let me get this all set up. Let me get all of the materials I need. Let me set this all up and I'll show you what, we, what we're going to do after that. And uh, rip Beatrice. <laughs> At least we have Craner is stupid. Our new baby girl. Alright, so here we go. I'm pretty sure I have everything. Remember at the beginning of this episode, I told you I had good news. Check this out. For you guys that aren't familiar with Captain Sparkle's old, uh, modded series, he had an old pet that he loved. Called Jerry. <laughs> 
I made a video that I'm gonna use these uh, web screen blocks. I I I'm gonna set all that up and also I got two command blocks from Zine. At a lot of you guys talk to Zine and tell Zine he needs to help me more in my series like he helps Captain Sparkles and uh, Craner. So I asked him for some help. He hooked me up with two, uh, two command blocks and he also hooked me up with an idea for these ender chests. I'll show you in a second. What I need to do, I have this floral blue powder, right? So I'm gonna color all of these just like this. And you'll see why in a second. <laughs> Let me pick all of these up. This is gonna be beautiful. And I have all these ender chests pumping into my MC or ME system. You'll see why in a second. First, let me set this up over here with Jordan's teleport pad. So check this out. <laughs> I'm not gonna let Jordan know that I found his secret passage into my base. I'm gonna cover it back up with these ghost blocks, right? So it looks just like normal. But as soon as he walks through the portal, watch what happens. It activates the, the command blocks and watch this. Whenever he walks through here, spy on my base, watch this. <laughs> Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna further refine it to make it uh, automatic, but look at this. It's just gonna be a never-ending loop of teleporting. <laughs> I just have to further refine it. This is gonna be good, though. <laughs> That's good, okay. So let's head back home. Right, like I said, oh good lord, S stop it! S that's why I made this, I, I made a house pet, Ho hold on, house pet. There we go. We are back home, house pet, eat the ender nuggets. <laughs> okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna set up all of these web screens. I have the videos already uploaded as unlisted on YouTube. We're gonna set this all up first. Let's go over to Captain Sparkle's house with the ender chests. So check this out. At Captain Sparkle's farm, he has all of this stuff automated. But as you can see here, his ender chests are locked to him. It has his name right there, so they're locked to him. But what I'm gonna do is, as you remember back at my base, I have at this ender chest that looks identical to his. <laughs> So what I'm gonna do, we're gonna look through his resources like iron. We always need iron. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna remove his ender chest. There we go. And I'm gonna place mine down. <laughs> so it looks just like his. He will have no idea that it's happening, right? And then this, I, what is this one? Obsidian? No, I don't care about obsidian. Enderium? No, I don't care. Ye oh, yellow right. Yeah, yellow right, so we can get endless amounts of power if we go the big reactor route. I don't know if we will go that route, but there we go. So let's replace that. Now we'll get yellow right. <laughs> and then the last ender chest is this here, the Manicio, so we can start on our magical crops easier. <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do now, like I said... I want to set up a TV in Captain Sparkle's house for a video and then Craner's house for the demo disc track. Right click to play me. <laughs> and then he's gonna look at this. Look at the thumbnail because of Tom and Jerry. <laughs> Watch this. Hey there, Jordan. So, uh, we, we meet again. But this time, I'm not gonna be so nice. I have found something that you may love even more than your cows. Your beloved cows that got ground up into ground beef. <laughs> if you want your beloved Jerry back, I suggest you do one thing. I hear you enjoy poems. <laughs> I want a seven line poem about how awesome I am and pretty I am sung to me on this video if you want your Jerry back. And if not, he may become acquainted with this lava. <laughs> you better sing well. So that's all you gotta do, Captain Sparkles. Sing me a sonnet, or sing me a seven line poem telling me how pretty I am. <laughs>
And then you get your precious Jerry back. All right, now let's head over to Craner's base. Let's set up the, a similar television with his demo disc track. And here it is, the disc track demo. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's play this. Yo, bro, you're rapping, sir, rapping, sir. This is just a demo, homie. Full version dropping soon. Prepare your butt. Watch, watch, watch. Prepare your butt. This is just a demo, homie. Full version dropping soon. Prepare your butt. Yo, bro, your rapping skills are whack. And once I'm done, you'll wish you were on Prozac. You're ugly, Craner, and your mother sure should hid you in a container. Container. Yo, bro, your rapping skills are whack. And once I'm done, you'll wish you were on Prozac. You're ugly, Craner, and your mother sure should hid you in a container. Container. Your rapping, sir, rapping, sir. This is just a demo, homie. Full version dropping soon. Prepare your butt. Watch your rapping, sir. Wait this is it? just a demo, homie. Full version drop dropping soon. Pre pre pre. Yo, bro, your rapping skills are whack. And Wait once I'm it? done, you'll wish you were on Prozac. Your ugly trainer and your mother sure should hit you in a container. Container. <laughs> container. Container. <laughs> dropping 11 19 2016, which is next Saturday. <laughs> I found an app on my phone that uh, mixed my voice within like five seconds, so I just used that for a demo. But coming up soon, we will have a fire rap battle. <laughs> Anyways, dudes, for now, I'm going to end this here. If you guys have enjoyed, of course, hit that like button down below. Keep showing your support for this series. And if you're at all new to my channel and are looking forward to this rap demo or this rap uh, disc 